I'm Liza DeGio. Welcome to Media Mulch, your down and dirty roundup of the best of the green wide web, where we do all the digging so you don't have to. What are you waiting for? Make the switch. Oh, okay. You love the warmth and the light of inefficient incandescent bulbs. Well, would a chart help? Recently, the New York Times has been going in depth on the CFL subject. They tested the leading bulbs for energy usage, lifespan, and consumer appeal. Head to nytimes.com for this handy dandy comparison chart and an informative interview with a leading light bulb scientist. No, I didn't make that up. See? There he is. <laughs> Get out your calendars, Palm Pilots, Blackberries, Post-it notes, whatever you crazy kids use these days, and mark this down. March 29th, 8 p.m., Earth Hour. For 60 minutes local time, millions of people from Brisbane to Toronto will turn off their lights. It's a simple action, but a powerful message. And the message is this. It's very rare in the pace of modern life that we stop and think about how much we consume and the way we live our lives. So. On their site, you can get involved in this global movement and learn how to reduce your footprint. So surf around. Just don't forget to hit the switch when you're done. Rich people used to just jump on their beds and throw money in the air. Now, they build cities. While neighbor Abu Dhabi is building Mostar City, the world's first carbon-free metropolis, Dubai's Falcon City of Wonders is taking a different route. And by different, I mean an energy-sucking eyesore that puts Vegas to shame. On falconcity.com, you can check out the project, which includes a fake Eiffel Tower, a fake Taj Mahal, and what might be the world's biggest electricity bill. Though they claim to have eco-friendly apartments, there is no other mention of renewable energy. Guess we'll have to write them a scathing email. That's it for Media Mulch. If you dig up anything cool, send an email to titangreens at titantv.com.